are in Colmar. We arrived to like 10 minutes ago. We're taking a break first because we didn't have any uh, in the hotel. Finally, some some quiet place. Hello, guys. Welcome back to the channel. We're in Colmar today. We took a breakfast here, and now we're visiting what we call the Little of Venice, and it's beautiful. But it's going to be a very hot day today, so uh, I'm not looking forward to it. put that to to the wall because if not everything is going to fall down but look at that look at the window the window is getting out the door. était plus joli que Strasbourg, que Strasbourg. Probablement parce que c'est plus petit, plus chaleureux. Ouais. Et en vrai, c'est plus, plus propre, c'est plus beau, il y a moins de gens bizarres. Et l'expérience, le, mmh. en vrai, elle est meilleure. Moi, je préfère vraiment Colmar. Ouais. Moi aussi. Plus euh, villageois, familial. Mmh. Euh, mmh. Ouais, voilà. Strasbourg, c'est plus grand, c'est une grande ville. En fait, c'est trop grand. C'est trop. Il y, y a trop de tout. But that's a personal opinion. I just wanted to try. I know a lot of people will say no, Strasbourg is better because actually it's bigger and blah blah blah. That's a personal opinion. But I guess you, as a tourist, to visit smaller cities are better because you you really get to like to really experience things. You know, you have the space to see things, to witness, and then to to take pictures and. Then, and to eat without, you know, like being in a crowded restaurant, and it's better. I'm hungry. That's my main plate. That's main plate. Those are both, you know, what we call like salad. There are like different stuff inside. And that's our main dish because it's hot, and then actually it's it's plenty of things. But you have to know that this is just the entry here for most of the people. And then they take a meal, a main plate, and then a dessert. I just don't know how, how people do here around around here to eat that much, but anyway. vineyards there there and this mom we stepped out of Colmar to go to a small village with a German name this is what I'm not gonna try to pronounce it but it's one of the most beautiful medieval village of France and we're gonna try to visit it all the street signs are written with German names and I have no idea how to read it read them actually So the people can say that. Hey, yeah, yeah. It's beautiful. And 
mean, that looks delicious. I think. We're back in the car. This small village is extremely beautiful. I really felt in my element because there were just not many people and it was really like just, you know, slow life, slow, just slower, less noise, less people. It, it was it was really great. And now we're heading to Ribovier, which is another one, which is like five kilometers away. So this is amazing guys, hi mom. We are in the Harry Potter mu Toys Museum and this is just awesome. It makes me think about all my childhood memories, I guess. This is awesome.
that's so cute. They recreated a whole city. This is amazing. Thank you. 